Racing in the catch a glimpse and coming out really well. Lady Azalea in the center with bold script up the inside and Charmaine's mirror and eye in the sky going through. Eye in the Sky has run out in front. About a length to Lady Azalea and the leader going at a good pace on the inside, Bold Script and Charmaine's Mere to the outer. And then CC Tequila, second last, Miguel Betty and Stifling taken up a bit at the back. Racing with the lead, Eye in the Sky rolling out in front under a bit of a tight rein now by a length to Lady Azalea, Charmaine's Mere the outside on the rails, Bold Script. In the center, CC Tequila, Miguel Betty skirts the field on the outside and at the back, Stifling's three behind. Racing down to the three eighths and out in front, Eye in the Sky from Charmaine's Charmaine's Mere, this leader's done it really well. Bolt script on the inside, called on. Around the outer goes My Gal Betty. And Lady Azalea's back in the centre, down the lane in the catch a glimpse. And out in front, eye in the sky. Tackled by Charmaine's Mere, My Gal Betty and Bolt script finishing up on the inside. They all come at this leader. Eye in the sky trying to hang on. On the outer coming at this leader is My Gal Betty, then Bolt script. CC Tequila is late. But My Gal Betty running away. My Gal Betty looking all over a winner from Charmaine's Mere, bold script, and down to the line. My Gal Betty has scored well. My Gal Betty four length, Charmaine's Mere. Bold script third, Eye in the Sky was fourth. 111.62. the victory here today and this time a stakes win in the catch a glimpse The Catch a Glimpse goes to the very game My Gal Betty ridden today by Rafael Hernandez, trained by Roger Atfield for uh, Bill and Betty Werner. I know who uh, My Gal Betty is named after, the lovely Betty. Uh, Rafael, tell me about this. The outside post position, probably a distinct advantage for you. You were able to let the other Phillies knock heads and then get them late. Yeah, that's good. Uh, we got a good both position. We just play by ear, we'll see who's going to go. Uh, in, in the speed, and we just set off behind and just make it one run. It was uh, certainly disappointing for you last race, I know. It's tough to talk about because she really could be an undefeated filly. She raced gamely, but she redeemed herself today. That's right. Yeah, she come back tonight and she show up. You know, the same thing he showed up last time, so she just must the best last time. So come out, show up today, she must the best. All right, well, keep smiling. You're doing great. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Roger. Thank you the honor. Roger, tell me about Betty. What makes her so special? She's awesome. Yeah, she's um, she's always been she's always trained well for me ever since I got her in Florida, and um, and just a sweetheart of a filly actually. And um, you know, I, I was quite upset, uh, you know, when she got taken down the other day. I knew that she probably was going to have to be, but uh, it was unfortunate because I thought she was much the best. And uh, but anyway. That, uh, I was so pleased with her today, and of course you, you're always anxious when the weather changes like this and you have no idea how they're going to handle that kind of going, and um, anyway, obviously she does, so yeah, she it's, it's, well. it's good, yeah. Yeah, no, she was extremely impressive. I know you're one, you're a master of the game, you like to walk the turf course sometimes and see what's going on, you were okay with how it was, obviously. Yeah, well, when I walked it this morning, it was totally different than probably it is now. So it didn't, I could have saved myself the energy, couldn't I? <laughs> All right, well, stay away from it, because keeping her in was the right decision. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. Congratulations to Roger Atfield, Rafael Hernandez, and the Werners with my gal Betty in the Catch a Glimpse.